Welcome back, everybody. Oh, it's about to be night time. Let's slow, uh, slow it down. Let's slow it down. I hope you're all having an awesome day. If you like it, subscribe. That would be amazing. Right, first thing we're going to do is I'm going to start setting up some sluices over here. So we're going to remove this and we're going to uh, have a little bit of play around and test while we're at it. They are fairly expensive and I don't actually know how much of a gap we need here. Judging by how full this is going, I reckon we could get rid of one of these. I don't think he counts. <laughs> so, one, two, three, four. We might be able to get away with three. Maybe. I did just put this here. I'm not sure if that's cut it down a bit. Doesn't look like it. So we're going to put at least two in here. I want to get, I would love to have all of this. So we can make this stay nice and full. Uh, we'll probably utilize it here too. Similar thing, except what we might do is... Um, I'm trying to figure out how do we make it go so it only opens when this is contaminated. But all the other water goes along here. So close below contamination of zero. Here's the thing. And this is what I was thinking about. Um, and Mike brought up a very good point. If we were to sluice this instead of say here we're going to end up with a pocket of bad tide water that's going to go nowhere and if we have it at close above contamination of zero they'll never open good thinking man great bloody thinking however we're still going to end up with that problem unless we come out to like here somewhere so sluicing this off might be a little interesting however i have planned to get out here and that's being because i think what we might do is sluice bad tide somewhere around here dig a channel through same here somewhere perhaps and uh maybe have it you know so the bad tide gets sluiced off and heads this way uh not sure yet because we can also elevate things and have the have it coming straight over the top of other stuff not sure how we're going to get there but i'm going to do some testing with this here and i suppose with you too now is the water actually flowing through here Close above downstream depth of 10. So if we were to do this, nothing flows. If I was to do this, that's quite clearly flowing. Close below contamination of 0%. Close below contamination of 100%. Right, so that actually stops it off. Close below contamination. So if the contamination is at 100% it'll open well we, we know that's not the case right because it doesn't close at zero right I will work it out we'll work it out I'll do some testing but I want to get them out over here first so we at least solve um this problem and stop the water flowing away but yes I think we might have to dam block on um, levy sluice this and do we lift it up that is a great question. That is a great question. Because it'll just flow this way unless we block this off and block this off. Because we have all of this. I don't know, maybe we turn it into a giant tank or maybe we make one. Because it flows in about three or four stories high, right? Yeah, it's up here. It's on this level. So, we might be able to make a giant tank up here anyway. Sorry, I'm zipping all over the place. We might be able to turn this into a giant tank. But we'll think about, we'll think about, right, but we're going to need more industry in order to do that because we're going to need a lot more metal because we have actually run out of it. Do we have scrap metal with us? We do. We need more storage for that. Okay. Give me a large pile. And, ah, uh, do we put it over here? Do we put it over here? And have the haulers haul it from there all the way over this way. Where is the nearest mine from here? There. All right, so branching industry out this way is probably a good idea. In fact... This will get bad tided, won't it? Unless we block it off. I was wondering if we should just steal this metal because it's closer than that one. That's miles away. That's a long route to travel. Uh, let's let's get the storage in. I'll think about this later off camera somewhere else doing, while I'm doing something else. Uh, where do I stick you, though? Huh. On top of their house? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Why not? The game will let me do it. Why not, right? We'll have the stairs come off sideways. Get me that pile again. Bonk. Get me the steel in there. 
Get me a road, because we need two squares of that. There and there. Beautiful. All right. Let them get on it. Okay. I'm going to get them getting more industry and uh, building that up a bit. We've got one of these things hopefully coming soon. Oh, it's too far away from a district. Okay, we'll have to get a road out there. All right, guys. I'll bring you back shortly when... Um, oh, look at that. But there's some more going on. <laughs> yes, I realized after they'd built the second one and they were about to build the third one that that was probably a silly idea because contaminated water is never supposed to get in here. Ever. This is supposed to be always a clean water lake, so I replaced it with that. Uh, we are, however, going to build these... Oh, I deleted them. We'll have them build these stairs because bad side is here. It's on its way. So I want to be able to get out here. Well, what we'll do is we'll pause these stairs so they don't build this. I want to get out here and see um, what we can do about this. Because I'm thinking we need to do something along here like that. Right? Oh, or do we just go straight for solving the problem? Let's just go straight for solving the problem. Let's get them to build those stairs, then we'll head up this way, and then we'll just go solve this issue. However, this is going to be a great test, so we need to close you, open you, open you. You actually need to, um, uh, close below contamination of zero. So that way it al always lets the bad tide flow until there's none, then it shuts off. Um... Uh, Hmm. Interesting. Because I want this to so be associated with this. Right? No. Maybe we'll see. We'll see. We've got we've got a day to wait, and we'll see how that works. But we have a backup here, just in case. We can drop this. Um, hope, have you guys get it? Yes, we've got our first giant windmill. Let's get another one. That sticker. Guys, could you get... Oh, you are getting rid of them trees. Nice. Uh, sticker there. This gives us more power. Because we're going to need it. Because I'm thinking we get another metal worker in. So we can smelt more metal stuff. Um, yeah, I want to put it there. So let's get two of these in here replace that road with it in fact what we'll do is we'll get rid of this because i'm going to forget to do this and wonder why nothing's working <laughs> y'all know me that that happens a lot we'll get that down to go like so so they can keep working on power down here all right uh nothing needs to be done this end i don't think so the plan will be to let this back up a bit and let the water come the normal water come straight through maybe we even levy it up make it even higher we'll let the bad side flow straight out this way maybe hmm we need dynamite don't we yes we do what do we do about you hmm and we've got 0.3 days 0.3 days alright give me this bad boy uh where are you yeah, give me one of these. This is very expensive uh, to build. So put you there. Pause real quick. Give me a metal guy. Stick him there. Make him important. All right. All the water's going to stop flowing. So let's get you closed off. Actually, we'll close you off first. This, because this will keep going. If I remember correctly. Now, you're shut. We'll have you flow outwards keep you open for now let's make sure this fills up there it is that was quick close that then close this open this we get some flow going immediately those are already all the way down all right let's hope and pray for the best we need the water to be flowing so that when this starts it's already flowing yeah, you're closed, you're closed. This is a problem too, because this is all going to get contaminated. We're going to have to let this flow out. So we really need to get over here and deal with this. I want to see what happens here though. Oh, let's hope we don't all die, eh? I mean, I don't even know if this will get contaminated because it's going to stay full of this stuff, isn't it? Bad tide, our first bad tide has arrived. 
Looks like we're right, it's flowing this way. Okay, so some of this might die off. Same with some of this, so we need to get out here and deal with it. Yeah, we need to block this off, let fl normal water flow through and that contaminated water just stop up here. Alright, give me a ladder. So I see stairs, none of the mods are working. Uh, get me over here. If this doesn't flood, we'll start the process because we probably want to block it off. Dang, you know we want to block it off like all the way along here, eh? So yeah, some of that will get contaminated out, it's starting to seep in. Because obviously evaporation is a thing. So some of this will die off. We've got quite a few grilled spuddies. We're now getting in some of this stuff. So... We may want to look at building you. Hmm. Oh, that was quick. Alright, bad side's over. Let's let that flow out more. We could just unleash it. I think, I think maybe we have to. I mean, we've got a K, 1k of water. We should be alright, we should be alright. Let's just let this play out. Then we'll start moving in towards in this direction and uh, this way so this can stop and we'll sluice it here so only clean water comes through we'll figure that one out can't back flow so that's okay yeah see how long this is taking to drain out let's get it moving actually not that much that's a bit stupid Let's do it like this. Yeah? So there's more flow coming out this way. Then coming into it. Any's getting none's coming into it. This is causing the problem. Alright, let's bring you up to point nine. No, I'm just gonna keep going. Alright, close you off. Where's it gonna force it? Give me the water. Give it all to me. I guess the same here too. No one can get sick because there's no no ladders that... Oh, no, I take that back. Just, there's no ladders that lead into the water, so I don't think anyone can actually get sick. However, if it overflows, they will. But... Looks like we're clearing it out just fine. Okay. Alright. 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 We're good. We're good. Let's let that run for a bit. We'll be we unpause this and get them out here. I want them out this way, building this stuff. We need the dynamite. So what I might do is I might get them to work on this first. Because the dynamite's going to take a second to get here. Nah, it's not where I want it. I want it over here. Cancel that. Get the road out this way. That way we've got more more room to maneuver around if we want some. Alright, give me uh levy blocks. Let me see. If we were to go. What's the outlet here? Two. So we only need what, like a four? One, two, three, four. That'll work. One, two, one, two, three. Yep, four. Then give me a bunch of these. I think that's how that's gonna work, right? Get you to go like this. In case we ever want that. Right, now you fellas. Close above contamination of... So if, if the contamination hits 1%, it's going to turn off. Yes. Right? Yes. I think that's right. All right, let them get to it. All right, guys, I'll let them get building. We'll uh, bring you back when all of this is done and, uh, and something else is uh, happening. Oh, God. I need to unpause you, don't I? All right, guys. See you soon. We have a plan. Oh, we have a plan. On top of here, we're going to put three sluice gates. We're going to demo all of this out. Maybe even a little bit more. It's a two input, so two output should be fine. Um, hopefully without an overflow here. If we set this right, we, we should be okay. We may need to make this bigger. I don't... Mm. Yeah, let's make it bigger just in case. Let's take these out. Let's make it one bigger. Uh, we'll take this out, actually. I could have left all of that stuff alone. 
Great. Okay. I will take you out of there. We need to come down on at least another level. Uh, then we're going to block all this off. All the way from here to here. And then we'll bring it over like this. We'll put another block like this. Just in case, right? Actually, you probably aren't necessary. Because the water's going to come down here. It's going to spread. And then it's going to fall and flow that way. And then we'll do the same thing over here. Similar thing with this. Except if we've got the resources, we might have it go over the top. Because you can put... Where are you? This, right? This can go on top of these. So you can create a, uh, like an aqueduct. Yes, this is done. Uh, no, it's not going anywhere. Interesting. I guess it's all backed up. Look at that. It's not actually moving. Interesting. I have these set. I think you saw this. Two above contamination of zero. Uh, so the moment it gets any sort of contaminant, it just shuts off. Uh, that might work. I don't know. I think it should. Over here, I don't think we're going to need to bother with it anymore because we're going to do this bad boy now. So we'll die of those. We'll get this. We need to make sure we can get over here. So let's grab a path. Go like so. We also need to get down here. So give me one of these. Followed by a couple more of these guys. Beautiful. Hello. Oh, it's a bush. Who cares? Okay, so we get up there, get all that. Uh, we'll get this stuff. Okay, let's get a sluices gate. These things, the Majigaba Bobs in there. We'll set them to... This doesn't really matter so much. Close above contamination of zero. Um, uh, actually, no, yeah, because this controls the height, the height on the other side, doesn't it? Uh, close when above downstream so it really wouldn't matter because it's oh wow look at that oh my okay it does the, oh oh that's neat mate oh that is neat as i didn't realize it would do that oh that's cool so oh wow oh this has got so many different uses all right we'll just whatever doesn't really matter where it's set as long as it's above this level all right, get out here and build... Oh, what are they doing? Right, yes, they're building a whole new housing network. <laughs> we started to run out of people. Uh, beavers, sorry. And as you can see, we need them making a lot more kits. We need more. I put in more trees. We've started this guy. We have this bad boy. And uh, a few more power things. We need a few more of these guys. What do we need? Paper. Planks. Oh, we're out of planks. That actually makes sense because we've been using quite a lot of them to do heaps of stuff. So we'll put you there, we'll flip you around, put you there. Bad water tanks, because yes, 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 I know I hadn't forgotten. Had not forgotten, I just hadn't put them in yet, but now they're in. Uh, so we get some bad water out of there. I'm also wondering if we can create like a bad water reservoir that keeps itself topped up. We'll think about it. Let me get, because this is all going to disappear. We need more trees. You can only get that far, so let me grab these guys. Grab another forest, actually. Yeah, you can't reach this far at all. Give me another forester right here. Stick in a bunch more oak trees down here, because we can. Uh, we're going to need a woodcutter, at least one. Now, Mike, uh, um, Mike O'Donnell has posted a really cool, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, sort of video showing how the woodcutters and the forester work together. Pretty neat. Very helpful. He's got, a, he's got a few videos like that. That's the kind of videos he does. Check out his channel. Have a look. Um, you can find it via the Discord. Um, why aren't you guys building out here? You know what? I was going to put them on 20 Fridays. But instead, you know what? I might just let them get to it. I'm bringing you guys back when we've got... Yeah, we've got a, a bit, bit of this done. I, I would love to see this kind of finish today. Although I don't know if we'll get the chance. We do have some new toys in. So see you guys soon. Point two days away. And it arrives. The bad tide. Again. Alright, we're point one day. Let's open you. Get some flow moving. Let's close you off. I don't even know if we need to close these when this is open. I'm not sure. But we need this to not be happening. Thank you. Also, I have eliminated this guy to, so to, to, to prevent any future issues. Because I don't know what's about to happen here with this here. That's off. No one, uh, let's 
We're deleting this. I don't want them getting over here just in case. Everything still looks fine. We need this to flow that way though, not this way. Well, then that way would be more preferable. That's... Will you shut? Or will you let contamination, contaminated water through? It says... 15... It's closed! Hey! Oh, beautiful! B E A U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T U T Flow this way. How are we looking everywhere else? <laughs> okay. Alright. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You, are you shut? You're at point 0.9. Okay. Alright, okay. Alright, alright, alright. These are at point 0.9, so the water will stay up in here. You're even shut off, which is brilliant. Not bad side's over, because it only lasts like a day, because this is, you know, on easy. Alright, well that worked. Okay, let's uh, let it flood flow out a bit, I suppose. The water's actually probably going to flow through here first. Let's lower... That is already down. Okay. So this is actually probably going to come through here cleaner first. Whew. Right. Uh, the other problem we're going to have, of course, is when this is all flowing out here, this is going to back up down this way. So I reckon that maybe we put some more sluice gates up here somewhere. Just like we're doing here. The moment the water's contaminated, it just switches off and all the water flows this way. I, d I don't know if it doesn't flood though, you know what I mean? I, I don't, I, yeah, I don't know if it doesn't flood. Ooh, we're gonna have to build a backup to our backup. Okay. Let's uh, get these things flowing then. Right, there's a dam there, so it should be okay. Let's lift you back up to, say, 0 0.7. That way, it's still flowing out, but... Yeah! Oh, that's brilliant. So the water's going to flow through, and hopefully this water will come this way. I think we get rid of these. I think we dismantle these dams. Um, and replace them with platforms. Um, yeah, I might wait until their work day's over, though, then do that. Yeah, I might do that. that. That's probably a good idea. Uh, you're getting all of those. You're recovering all of that. We have five extra beavers doing nothing, and oh, wow, all the power's out. Uh, okay, fine. Uh, stairs. Put these stairs back in. Brilliant. Beautiful. All right, guys, I'm going to get them to build up some more. I'm going to get rid of these things so this water can actually flow. Actually, we can make that do that right now. Now that we're empty, let's close those. Have the water flow back this way. Hopefully, it'll go through here. There it goes. So you push through, lovely. And it'll flood straight here. Good, okay, because you guys are at 0 0.7. Let's raise you up to 0 0.9. So you match this guy. Who's now also gonna be 0.9. So the water can back up a little further. Good, good, good. This doesn't flow out. Why are, oh. Oh, because it overflowed that. We need to take those out. Oh, no, it's going to, it could flow out this way. Can it? No, because it's overflowed that too. We just have to wait for it to evaporate. Okay, so far so good. Yep, all this is leaking back out this way. This is coming through. Although this is being fed this way for some strange reason. Why are you flowing back? You shouldn't be flowing back. You should be flowing through here. Although this is full, so who knows? All right, guys. I'll bring you back shortly when uh, there's more to show you. Like, hopefully, this getting finished. Oh, wow. Let's get in there. Awesome. All right. I'll see you soon. All right. We have it in. It's there. Let's give it a test. Let's see if it all flow. I mean, let's give it a test. We know this is going to work. Open. Closed. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, let's stop wasting the water. 
All right, automatic. We have this close below contamination of 100%. So this is, will um, close when above contamination of zero. So the moment it gets to 1%, this will just shut. Wow. Um, should have opened him first, huh? Oops. Just have it set to open. Now set it to auto. Close when downstream depth is above two. It'll never be above two. The contamination will always be at zero. Good, good, good. I don't like the fact that it floods in here. Um, hmm. Yeah, that's... That's a little wrong, a little nasty. What we probably should do is put levees above all of the... Ooh. Ooh, yeah, okay. Get rid of the road. If you select just the road and hold shift, it should just get rid of the road and not everything else. Thank goodness that still works. Um, okay, let's start at this end. Ugh. Oh, no, not this again. <laughs> okay, let's do it like this. And then work our way back one piece at a time. Just in case it'll stop that overflow from ever happening again. Um, which we kind of want to do in case bad tide ever does that. Now, up here. How do we deal with all of this? I think maybe we put a ladder here. Ah, son of a... I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. Go away. <laughs> Let's uh, put the road straight along and go into there. Do we divert it here? Into this? And then bring it this way? It's just that has to go... Yeah, we'll have to levy block, won't we? We'll have to do something like this. All the way around it. Oh, man, I'm not liking the sound of that at all. Hmm. Hmm. I guess we don't have a choice, do we? Because this is one level higher. Like, this is on the same plane as this and this. So to have the bad side, we're going to have to come back here. And divert it this way. Okay. Okay, I'm cool with that. Um, in that case then, let's dig a road straight through these trees. I don't think we're going to need them. So let's just rip out this. And then we'll rip out these. And we'll rip out these. In fact, you know what? Keep, 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 all of it go. All of it get out of my way. We'll get rid of all those things. All right, well, now that we've got this up and running, this is now automatically diverted, I hope. I hope. Uh, we still have this, just in case the flow does come back this way. We can turn this open. We can open that up. Open that up in case this gets contaminated. So we have a couple of buffers, just in case. It's this I want to deal with next. If we can deal with this inlet, we should be fine. Because that's the only other bad tide spot that can hit us unless this over this can't overflow so we should be okay look there's still water in here it hasn't drained out it's still in there in fact yeah because all this is one giant pool this is all considered to be one thing so it's going to evaporate a lot slower than this is although in saying so that's still there too okay all right good 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 not bad not bad uh what's next though that we should oh yeah yeah good boys good beavers Get moving. Who doesn't like a good beaver? Okay, let's plan this out. We're going to want sluice gates. You know what? Let's do it like this. Let's put them in here. Uh, how what's the inlet? Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So four will do the job. But let's get five. Okay. And that way, what we'll do is we'll direct it like this. we still got to demolish all of this though and we've got to demolish all of this pretty sure we're gonna have to take out a substantial chunk here because the gap here will be too wide hmm don't think it's wide enough you know what i'm gonna plan this out i'll get them working on it bring you guys back shortly i was gonna wait until the bad tide showed up but uh, I'm running a bit out of time today, so uh, something we've always wanted to be able to do, put dynamite on paths. That's now a thing. Wow. Awesome. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> My ability of keeping these episodes under half an hour is clearly terrible, but I've got to keep them under 15 gigs, otherwise I can't upload them to other platforms. So. 
We'll go over here. We'll do these bad boys too, shall we? Let's uh, do this. <laughs> okay, because this is in. Also, as I was building this, I kind of realized there was a problem over here. So, with these sluice gates being here and set to 100% contamination, the water in here would have had to have got have, have had to have got to 100%. Um, sorry, in, in here it would have got 100% switch off, and then this one would have had to have gotten to oh, where was it? Close up below 100%. Yes, this would have had to have got to 100% first, but it's already shut, so it wouldn't have let anything through, and it would have just flooded. At least that's how I I see it. Right? Because no, this water would not have flowed that way because it was it's already shut off. So it would have had to... I'm not sure how to automate that properly unless we put them butting up against each other. Because these are going to turn off the moment there's a single piece of contamination. And then the water's going to build up. And it won't open here until it gets to 100%. Because if we set it to like, say, 3... Close above. Yeah, so if we were to set it to close below, like, one. Close below. The moment it got to two contamination, it would open, wouldn't it? I wanted to test that, but I guess we can't test that exactly right now. Um, we do still have our fallback, of course, right here. And uh, we can always open this guy just in case something goes wrong and it doesn't work. Uh, we'll have it at one speed when we turn it on, but let's turn you off. I want to make sure this flow works. Let's turn you off. Turn you open. And let's see. Let's see if the water... I should have opened that first. Always open the outlet first before shutting off the other... The, the, the old outlet. Don't do what I do and do it the other way around. That's just silly. Because it stopped, but the, the flow's not there. It just overflows. That looks like it's working. All right, so what happens if I was to do it over here as well? I've done it again. I've done it again. Open. Closed. Now it shouldn't overflow, right? Perfect. Right. How does this work? Everything down here seems to be working just fine. Also, did they buff the water in the food? Um, we're at like 100 beavers, and I haven't had to do anything. I'm a little bit confused by this. Um, these things haven't moved since we've done this. Oh yeah, I'm chopping all these down, putting more food here. We're going for wheat. We're going to start the wheat production. It works. It absolutely works. Right, open you. Close you. Uh, automate you. So let's just put them all on automation so they go back to the way they were. Right, so I've got the same thing set here. So the moment the all this fresh water is pushed out of here... By the contaminated water. Oh god, what did I do? Close below contamination. Oh, not close. Oh no. Right? Force it this way. Yes, so the moment this water turns contaminated 100%, this, it'll start flowing this way. So. Although, don't we still have the same problem? Because the moment it gets to 1% contamination, this is just going to build up and it's still going to be fresh water and it's not going to flow that way until that gets to 100%. So this one block in here, when the bad tide starts to flow, this one block will start to empty out until the 1% of it turns into contaminated water. When that happens, this is going to shut and this is going to start pooling. And then it will start to overflow until these blocks reach a hundred uh, until these blocks reach a hundred percent these aren't as important as these ones so but if we were to say close below this it's just going to start flowing right wait no <laughs> okay did we just figure it out so if I have that at one percent water okay all right all right maybe that's how it is maybe that's how it is so close below one percent close below one percent so the moment it gets to one percent it opens open above contamination level of one percent 
Okay, I think that might be the way. Then what should we set this at? Uh, close above contamination of 1%. Right? Because that, that evens it out then, yes? So the moment this gets 1%, stops here, flows this way instead. And with it already having a bit of a backup, hopefully it won't overflow. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's set this to close above 1%. Yeah, because there's no, like, infographic for this. There's nothing that says exactly how this works. You just, I guess we just, I guess we just figured it out. All right, well, we'll find out in the next bad side, guys. And that's going to be in the next episode because we actually have a drought coming. So in the next episode, however, we're going to be building up more industry. That's right. We're going to get a lot. Wow, they're, they're fast. We get a lot more and work our way out to the mine and figure out what we're going to do here because I want more green land. I want more land for trees. I want to fill this up with water. I want to figure out how to deal with our bad tide. Um, we are heading out this way too. It's a little secret project I've been working on. All right, guys. If you're enjoying this, like, share, comment, subscribe. Um, thank you very much. Uh, thank you to my channel members and patrons. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to become one, links down below. We have our new toys. This seems to work. The vote is in. All right, guys. Let's see if it works. See you in the next one.